Okay, now we're going to do 7-81a. If y represents the distance in miles and x represents the time in minutes, write an equation to represent the distance traveled for any time. Okay, so we're probably going to write an equation in the form y equals mx plus b. Uh, and we know b is probably going to be 0 because this is a proportion, so I won't need to write down b, but I will need to write y equals m times x. So the m is what we're looking for, which is um, the slope or the rate. And I know I can get a rate for how many minutes um, we know we've got three miles per minute, sorry, for every 20 minutes. And I know that I just, if I just put that over one minute, I've turned it into a rate. So I can actually just leave it as 3 20ths. And I can go ahead and write this equation, y equals 3 20ths times x. Because we know if we multiply 3 miles over 20 miles times x, which is miles, then the miles are going to cancel out and it will just be um, whatever this is times 3 times 20. So here's our equation for um, representing the distance traveled for any time. So if we put in an x, then we can figure out how many miles.